On his return from Tehran following talks with Russian and Iranian officials, Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan talked to reporters. Erdogan stated that he was still hopeful a ceasefire agreement can be reached regarding Idlib and that they should be working together to prevent a humanitarian tragedies from happening in Syria. Now, Russia has rejected calls for a ceasefire in Idlib, stating that terrorists in the region should be cleared out. However, Turkish President Recep Tayyip Erdogan stated, and I quote, we will not accept any operation on civilians in the pretext of the fight against al-Nusra. This would cause a major humanitarian crisis and a new influx. Turkey should not be in a position to pay the cost for such an operation. Now, Turkish officials have stated that uh, once an operation begins, they believe that thousands of Syrians will likely head to the Turkish border and that Turkey right now does not have room to host any more refugees as Turkey is currently hosting over 3.5 million Syrians. Turkey has also increased its military presence at the southern border with Syria as a new convoy of military trucks has arrived in Hatay. This is Mikhail Bardavid for CGTN in Istanbul.